Well, thank you. Hi, my name's Carrie Snow. Hi, I feel great tonight. I really do. I do. I'm wearing a $55 bra and a thong from the 99 cent store. And my life is very balanced and very good. I know it's disturbing thinking about a grown up woman wearing a thong. I can see by the look on some of the gentlemen's faces, but uh, it's like manifest destiny for underwear. You know your panties are going to end up there anyway, okay? You might as well beat him to the punch with a smaller piece of fabric. That's all I'm telling you. And I'm not just a comedian. Oh, no. Oh, no. No, no. I'm not just a comic. I am a producer also, and I'm trying to start the first comedy channel in the Middle East, okay? It's called the G Ha Ha Channel. And, and this is our slogan. This is our slogan. Let's get ready to la 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 laugh. And, My boyfriend's younger than I am. Yoo-hoo, yeah. Yeah, I, I never actually had a boyfriend, per se. I used to diet most of my life, and I was kind of busy losing and gaining 100 pounds every five years to form, <laughs> thank you, uh, meaningful relationships. And, uh, and I, had, uh, I had servicemen. Servicemen? The trumpet player, the grip, and the Nazi? Anybody? OK. <laughs> And I used to do every diet in the world. I had lost 100 pounds on Optifast, had two plastic surgeries. I had my boobs lifted. And I, when I mean lifted, I mean right to here, OK? Because I figured they'd sag slower. I'd be more fun to dance with. And you know that pencil test to see if you could go without wearing a bra, OK? Yeah, I could have stored a laptop computer. That's all I'm telling you. And I, so I'd lost 100 pounds, uh, you know, Optifast. I didn't know Oprah was already gaining her weight back because she never called me. And I'm in therapy trying to find out why I was the one to gain the 100 pounds back. And I'm telling the therapist about my personal life. I tell her about the trumpet player, the grip, and the Nazi, and she's horrified, you know? I think it only scared her once before when I wouldn't leave the office till she told me what size her skirt was. And um, it's a four, but it's genetic. And uh, and so, yeah, and it is genetic. Oh, oh, I found out later I had a stomach the size of a large Russian woman pulling her own plow. <laughs> no longer efficient in today's modern world. And, uh, oh, it is so genetic. And I finally had gastric bypass surgery, you know, stomach stapling. I had mine, uh, uh, what, paper clipped. It was cheaper. And <laughs> it's an office supplies joke. And, uh, yeah, and so now I take other, it's been like 13, 14, I take other people through the surgery. Friends of mine from Seattle stayed with me before they saw my doctor, you know, I, yeah. So I'm the Underground Railroad for fat people. Um, I'm Harriet Tubbyman, I swear. <laughs> <laughs> 